doing there? Didn't you get the memo? The place is closed down, at least for a while. Someone used one of the suits. We had a spare in the back, a yellow one. Someone used it. Now none of them are acting right. Listen, just finish your shift. It's safer than trying to leave in the middle of the night. Uh, we have one more event scheduled for tomorrow, a birthday. You'll be on day shift. Wear your uniform. Stay close to the animatronics and make sure they don't hurt anyone, okay? Uh, for now, just make it through the night. Uh, when the place eventually opens again, I'll probably take the night shift myself. Okay, good night and good luck. Hey guys, figured I'd just give you a quick run through on how to play Five Nights 2 in case you weren't quite getting the mechanics. Um, from the left vent, you have Balloon Boy and Shaker. Both of those get scared away by the mask. Up the main hall, the only one that gets you is uh, Foxy and Mangle. Uh, the mask scares away Mangle, Foxy scared away by 5 to 7 flashes of the flashlight. Uh, Toy Bonnie and Mangle also come at you from the right vent. If you hear radio static, that's Mangle. It means apply the mask and he goes away. Um, and if you just check it and you see Bonnie's there, put the mask on, it comes out straight away. Um, we haven't yet seen Freddy. Uh, Freddy can appear in the office on the left near the TVs there. And if you flash your flashlight at Freddy when he jumps up, um, you will die. Uh, finally, the two most dangerous are Withered Bonnie um, and Chica. Uh, Freddy behaves similar. And when you bring the laptop down, they might just be standing there. Um, they, you require the fastest reaction time for those ones of any other animatronic. You just got to apply the mask as quickly as possible. Um, yeah, and that's pretty much it. Enjoy. Tell you what though, this one is a relief after playing Five Nights 4. That is a brutal game, that one. <laughs>
also guys if you want to support the channel uh, in the description of this video and the YouTube channel there is a link to a place called CUNY Surveys uh, it's one of the better survey places I've used um, just you complete surveys and you make between 50 cents and a dollar for each survey you do um, if you sign up with that link you'll immediately get 50 cents and I will also get 50 cents so you would be helping out the channel um, if you don't have anything better to do want to make between I don't know a dollar and five dollars a day doing paid surveys if you've got time to kill um, that's one way to do it uh, it hooks directly up to your PayPal in a manner of similar to Listverse. If you were to like write list Listverse and get them published and make a hundred dollars on that as well. But yeah, reasonably safe. Um, obviously, um, you can cancel the surveys at any time, and you can use other services to have your data deleted if you're not comfortable with it. Um, but yeah. If, if, you, if that's something you might be interested in, give it a, give it a look.